SSN AUKUS, In-Depth Analysis of Royal Australian Navy's Nuclear Submarine SSN AUKUS. The Australian government has selected BAE Systems and Australian Submarine Corporation to build its new fleet of nuclear-powered submarines. This is the latest significant development in the AUKUS Trilateral Security Pact between the United States, the United Kingdom, and Australia. Australian Deputy Prime Minister Richard Marlas and UK Defence Secretary Grant Shapps announced the news in Australia. This is the next step in Australia's plan to build and operate its own nuclear-powered submarines. Thank you, and welcome to this channel. If you're new to this channel, please subscribe and click the bell icon to receive a notification when new content is released. SSN AUKUS Nuclear Submarine with a displacement of 10,200 tons and a complement of 135 crews, SSN AUKUS will be the largest, most powerful and most advanced attack submarine the Royal Australian Navy and Royal Navy have ever operated. From the late 2030s, it will start replacing the Astute and Collins classes. The SSN AUKUS will travel at 46 km per hour, have an unlimited range, and dive to a depth of up to 240 meters. The Royal Australian Navy will acquire five SSN AUKUS class boats built at the Osborne Naval Shipyard in South Australia. Australia expects to deliver its first SSN AUKUS submarine in the early 2040s. The BAE Systems will complete the program's design phase under the Australian government's $6 billion contract. British involvement. The SSN AUKUS class will be powered by a Rolls-Royce pressurized water reactor manufactured at an expanded Rolls-Royce Rainsway site in Derby, UK. BAE Systems will design and build the submarine's pressure hull and act as its primary integrator in Australia and the UK. American Involvement American Raytheon, Lockheed Martin, Boeing, Northrop Grumman, General Dynamics Advanced Information Systems and Hughes Aircraft Company will supply the SSN AUKUS with sensors, torpedoes and a missile system. The SSN AUKUS class will share a high degree of commonality and technology with the Virginia Class Block 5, including the American-made propulsion system improved MK-48 torpedoes, UGM-84 harpoon missiles, and BGM-109 Tomahawk cruise missiles. The Royal Australian Navy's nuclear submarine will incorporate Virginia-class Block 5 boats to increase firepower and payload capacity with the Virginia Payload Module, VPM. The VPM extends the length of Block V subs over previous versions of the Virginia class by adding a mid-body section to create more payload space. The sensor suite includes an evolved Big 1 combat management system, a BQQ-10 bow-mounted spherical active passive sonar array, photonic sensors, high-resolution cameras, light intensification and infrared sensors, an infrared laser rangefinder, an integrated electronic support measures array. Two redundant sets of these sensors are mounted on two BVS-1 photonics masts outside the pressure hull. The mast sensors transmit signals to the control center through optical fiber data lines and signal processors. The command center displays visual feeds from the masts on liquid crystal display interfaces. Thanks for watching. Thanks for visiting this YouTube channel. Visit GlobalDefenseCorp.com. Follow us on Twitter, Facebook, Instagram, LinkedIn, YouTube, and TikTok.